All right, this is TJ Clayton once again with Eagle Enterprises. Uh, I want to show you guys what to do uh, with the R Sport, Bumblebee, any kit where you've got to take off the back spoiler. Simple thing, simple tools you will need. We've got just a screwdriver with a socket. This is a 10 millimeter socket. We found that it works the best. Go to your local uh, parts store, pick up one of these tools. It's perfect for getting out these uh, fasteners. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what to do on this. Um, just simply pull this in. Pop out these fasteners first. You might have to find a spot in the metal to lean against. Just make sure you don't push through the felt. All right, now that we've got out all the fasteners, go ahead and pop off this clip. You do not have to take out these. These can stay. As you're taking this out, you have the easy release for the trunk. This just simply pulls right through here. Just get it out of your way. That way you have access. You have screws that are tucked in here that hold your spoiler in place. As well as we have screws tucked in behind these washers. These can be taken out with your, your fingers or just get a squeegee and pull them out. Alright, now that we've taken off all the black caps off these screws, we've got a multitude of six screws that you'll have to take off. Now when you're taking these off you have to be very careful not to lose them because they can fall down behind the metal of the trunk. So what we found to do is angle the trunk down the whole time you're unscrewing these. All right, what we found is that there is no uh, double-sided adhesive on these spoilers. So once you've gotten the bottom unscrewed, uh, all six bolts, go ahead and you're able to just uh, grab in the center. You've got one clip that's holding it here. So just take this off. Um, you'll be able to use, um, when you're doing your install on the R-Sport, if you're going for lineup, we'll show you that later on. But this is a simple way. Make sure you get cleaned very well around the, uh, these holes and go from there.